Hi, I'm Jerry McLaughlin, author of Cold Wax Medium, Techniques, Concepts, and Conversations, and co-producer of Cold Wax Medium, a video workshop. Welcome to Ask Jerry and Rebecca, a video series answering all your questions about Cold Wax Medium. Hi, this episode of Ask Jerry and Rebecca is coming to you from my living room in Oakland, California. And our question comes from Melinda Cusona, who's a figurative artist from Southern California. Melinda's question is, what's the difference between encaustic and cold wax medium? Now, this is a very common question and we get it all the time, but not just from artists who are interested in working with the media, but also from viewers who look at paintings that say cold wax medium and wonder, is this just some form of encaustic or are they the same thing? Well, they're definitely not the same thing. And to me, they share really two commonalities. And one is that they're used for painting. And two is that they are fundamentally made from beeswax. However, encaustic is really a way to make paint out of beeswax. You melt the beeswax and you add pigment to it and that then becomes your paint. You use that mixture to make your paintings. Cold wax medium, on the other hand, is really an oil painting medium. So you mix cold wax medium with oil paints, and then you take that mixture and you make your paintings out of it. Another fundamental difference to me is the use of heat. For encaustic processes, heat is absolutely essential. You have to melt the wax to get the pigment in there, and then when you want to use the wax to paint with it, you have to melt it. Once you paint your layers, you need to fuse those so that they stay together and don't come apart over time. Cold wax, on the other hand, is really a room temperature process. You just take the cold wax, mix your oil paint with it, and make your paintings. Not only do you not need to use heat, you actually shouldn't use heat with cold wax medium. It can liberate some toxic fumes and it's flammable. So Melinda, thank you for your question and I hope that that answered it. We'll see you next time.